Hi everybody, thank you for returning to my channel. Um, today I'm going to show you how to use the, oh excuse me, magic grab. Um, so here we go. So I've got a blank template here. I'm going to pop on one picture. So I'm looking at the picture and yes, it's it's a normal stock photo, but I only want some of the lipsticks to put as a little banner across the bottom. So it's a little bit tedious, but here we go. So we open up edit and it will bring up the magic studio. You will only be able to do this if you are a pro user as opposed to a basic user. So you click on the grab and then you hold down control. I do not know how to do it on a mobile, but you click on the items you want. Some of them will only pick out bits of the colours. So you have, it is a tedious job. Very tedious. So you go down and pick out the bits of the picture that you want to keep and use. So that's not taking that bit. So let's add that. And it's missed the top. There we go. And that bit. So we're going to grab those. So you allow it to do its thing. And it will say, grab a cup of And it does this. So you'll see there's a box now around what I've highlighted. So just move that to one side. Click on the other box. And delete it. And now <clears throat> you've got... a row of lippies to put at the bottom of your picture however big or small you want them and that's how you use a screen grab hope you enjoyed that nice and simple nice and easy and then you can do anything around it that you wish so if i made this smaller for instance I don't know, maybe I wanted a doody background. So let's put when it lets me. Oh no, it's decided to stop. Today would be good. So we want a pink sunset background. Let's have one of those. And just because I like video. I'm going to pop these down here. Set that as my background. And if I click onto there. My lipsticks can now be the White Cliffs of Dover. There you go. But you can do however you want. But that's how basically you use the magic grab within Canva. 
I'm certainly not sure how to use that particular element on a mobile phone, uh, but that's how I use it in Canva. Hope you got some value from that. It was a nice quick one today. If you did find some use in that little, little demo, do come back for another one. Thank you. Bye.